Every week, we are exploring Malaysia from different hotels, hostels, backpackers, and places to visit. Today, we drove from Kuala Lumpur to Getting Islands and stayed at the Greenwood Chalet Resort. Today we are in Gating Island, which is located about 50 kilometers from Kuala Lumpur, about an hour drive. Yes. And we are going to stay at Greenwood Chalet. Let me show you around. <laughs> They have nine different units here at the Greenwood uh, Chalet and it's between 200 to 350 ringgit per night and one includes the traditional Malay house. And of course we are going to show you our room with the very special features inside. So something really, really cool that I, you don't see very often in a hotel or a chalet or resort is they have a sauna inside the room. You just need to turn it on, then you can set up uh, the temperatures over here. It's going up to 60 degrees, I think. 60 degrees, you can put it in uh, Fahrenheit as well. So 50 degrees Fahrenheit is 124 uh, degrees Fahrenheit. And you can set up the time as well, up to one hour, I think. And then when it's ready, it's gonna let you know over here, operating. And you just open the door and you're ready to go. And if you are a big fan of karaoke, they also have a private karaoke room. their own kitchen and you can cook whatever you want over here they have the stove over there you can make coffee if you want and something really cool as well that tonight we're gonna do we're gonna be doing a barbecue tonight and they have the barbecue over there so later on today we're gonna go to the what is it called uh, supermarket and we're gonna buy some chicken and maybe some onions and food and we're gonna be cooking tonight so there is a few things to visit in getting island and one of them is called the premium outlet so it's like a lot of different branded store. stuff it's like a branded store where you can find coach lv yes boss yes. they have a, a lot of them so we cannot go to Genting Island without getting there of course <laughs> Fiza is gonna want to buy something it's <laughs> obvious <laughs> of course of course and after the premium outlet we're gonna take the cable car and bring you all the way to the top so there is like hundred different kind of shops over here and one of Fiza favorite ones called Cotton on. Cotton on, so we have no idea where is it because last time we were there was like two years ago, I think. Yeah. So let's try to find it for Fiza. I don't 
don't know about you guys, but as a man, we need to make sacrifice. Are you finding your happiness? Haha, <laughs> not yet. Haha. <laughs> Let's have a look. <laughs> My happiness, but I'm not for sure. How to go to another one? We're probably going to be spending here another two or three hours just shopping. Uh, no, it's not. <laughs> so this apparently is not the right shop. It's not the right cotton <laughs> on. So we need to go to another one. Like I said, we're probably going to be spending two hours over here just shopping. And we're not going to see anything else. My job is to follow Fiza around and to don't say anything. <laughs> I couldn't find anything that I want. So maybe next stop. Oh no, we just need to um, two tickets. Yeah. Two tickets to go up. And I think it's 18 ringgit per person. Go for it. for two things shopping lovers and gambling i don't know how many casinos they have over here but there is a lot it's already 2 30 and we still didn't have a uh, lunch so our mission now is to find a place to eat Vegetarian and cost you like 20 ringgit, it's about five dollars. And I have ordered the Nazi Goreng Kampung Ayam and it's also 20 ringgit, five dollars. And we also ordered one bottle of water, which was six ringgit, so it's like a dollar 20, a dollar 30 for the, the bottle of water. It's way, way more expensive than, than KL, but because we are getting a top. top getting island, that's why all the price goes up. In the same food in Kuala Lumpur, you probably pay six or seven ringgit for the Nazi Goreng. And how much would you pay for the laksa? Maybe eight ringgit, seven ringgit, seven or eight ringgit for the laksa. Oh my god, 
she's freaking out. <laughs> Just arrived to the Chin Shui Shu cave. cave. I'm so sorry if I pronounce it wrong. I have no idea how to pronounce it. So just for your information, guys, that's what we read online. So if we made any mistake, we're sorry. But the temple was built in 1975, but only operated in 1994. And I did not see it, but Fiza just told me that is a massive Buddha right in front of the, the Starbucks cafe. But we are looking for the Starbucks and we found it. It's a bit hard to find it actually. You need to go down like crazy. I don't know how many escalators we, we passed to, to go down like seven or eight escalators. And then you need to go all the way down. And this is a Starbucks. I did not spell my name right. It's Roman, no Wayan. <laughs> so the coffee uh, at Starbucks in Getting Island is also more expensive. It's 14 ringgit 50 here in Getting Island, while we pay maybe 9 ringgit um, something, I think, in, in Kiel. So 5 ringgit extra in Getting Island. and we almost arrive at the end of the day and we are planning to do a barbecue tonight at the Greenwood chalet but we have no idea where to buy the chicken so we just gotta go down there and try to find a place to buy the food we are actually looking for chicken breast and they don't have it here so we don't know how we're gonna cook the barbecue tonight Probably gonna ask the owner if he, he has chicken breast in his fridge, in his freezer. Otherwise, we may have to skip the, the barbecue for tonight. So Fiza is crazy about cats and she just saw a cat on the street, so she wants to feed him. Of course. So we always have food in the car. Look at this, who keeps a lot of food? For street cat, stray cat. Of course. My baby. How many cats do we have at home? Three cats. <laughs> <laughs> no matter when I see a cat on the street, I will feed them. And Be water. Clean well. water, not from the uh, tap water. No. <laughs> so my cat at home drink uh, cold water, cold water. Only. Only. Not tap water. No, no. no. <laughs> Oh my god, you're so scary! It's hard to get the cat now. How to do it? Huh? Put it on the floor and push it. Yeah. Oh, you're happy. Put it up, baby, you're hungry. Hey, what do? No, you put the keyboards on the, on the ground. <laughs> oh yeah, you can. Okay, we put it here. Okay, for you today. What can it? Um. Hello, buddy. One happy cat. One happy cat. So now we're happy. We've done our good action of the day. Yay. Are you happy? Very happy. Very happy. At least I fit one cat. <laughs> So as we couldn't find chicken breast, uh, Jackie, is it Jackie, yeah? <laughs> Say hello, Jackie. Hi. <laughs> Jackie found some chicken chop and some uh, sausage as well. So we normally don't really eat chicken chop or sausage, but I'm gonna eat sausage for you guys for, for today. 
<laughs> Just for today. We basically only eat chicken and fish with uh, with visa. We're trying to be vegetarian, so we reduce our meat intake. We try to don't eat beef at all. We eat beef maybe once every every month and a half or two months. So we're really trying to be vegetarian now. So this this is a good thing about uh, the Greenwood Chalet, as you can bring your own food and you can do a barbecue. Or you have all the space over here to uh, to bring all your friends and family and to to cook a beautiful meal. All right, guys. So this was our little escape in Getting Island and at the Greenwood Chalet. We hope that you have enjoyed uh, this video with us. And if you have not subscribed yet, yes. don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the notification bell. See you on the next video, guys. Bye-bye.